Bilby Moon Written by Margaret Sperling Illustrated by Danny Snell Now it's time to hear the story. Click on the green arrow when you want to go to the next page. Click on me if you want the pages to turn by themselves. One night, far away in the desert, a little bilby left her burrow for the very first time. She sat still, her ears alert, her nose twitching. She liked the sweet smell of the cool night air and the soft warmth of the sandy soil. But most of all, she liked the moon. It was big and round and shiny and bright, and its silver light was soft and gentle. Each night, when she left her burrow, she looked up to greet the moon. And each night, the moon looked down and smiled. But then, one night, the moon didn't smile. Little Bilby was worried. A piece of the moon was missing. trees grew. She met a hopping mouse, busy looking for seeds and insects. Oh, hopping mouse, said little Bilby, have you seen the moon tonight? A piece of it is missing. Each night, little Bilby saw that the moon was becoming smaller. Sand Dragon was sleeping in a hummock of grass. He was a wily daytime creature. Perhaps he would know what was happening. Oh, dragon, said little Bilby. Have you seen the moon tonight? Half of it is missing. dragon sleepily. I will look tomorrow. If I find it, I will tell you. And still, 
Night after night, the moon became smaller and smaller, and the desert became darker and darker. Echidna was scrabbling noisily in the dirt.
She looked in all sorts of places where she thought a moon might go. What are you looking for, little Bilby? Came a voice from the dark. It was Boo Book Owl. for the beautiful round moon, said little Bilby. It has disappeared. The moon hasn't really disappeared, said Owl. Sometimes we can see it. Sometimes we cannot. It will come back soon. And Owl was right. For the very next night, a bright silver crescent appeared high in the evening sky. confused. First, half the moon was missing. Now, half the moon was back. How strange, he thought, and went back to sleep. It sparkles on rocks, said Echidna. It glistens on dew, said Froglet. I am glad the world has a moon, said Little Bilby. Sand and told Mole all about the moon. Mm -hmm. 